Hey everyone, today I want to make a quick video of how to improve your ChatGPT experience by a tenfold. It's actually very easy and most people already have it who has ChatGPT Plus subscription, so make sure you stick around to learn. This basically boosted my results and my usage of ChatGPT at least 100 times. I've been using it every single day non-stop and it only doesn't work for ChatGPT 4, it also works for ChatGPT 3.5. So it's actually free and great for everybody. So the way it works, you go into your name right here in the bottom corner, and you go into customs instructions. And here, as you can see, the custom instruction is available on a separate page. I'll show you just ne uh, next. But here it's like, what would you like the ChatGPT to know about you to provide a better response? So here you can say, where are you based? What do you do for work? What are your hobbies and interests? What subjects can you talk about for hours? What are some goals for you? And as you can see, it has a 1,500 symbols. And I bet you not that it actually, all this works very, very well. So if I say that, oh, okay, I live in Malta and I say safe and here I say, okay, where do I live? It will actually respond to me with the actual message. It's incredible. So basically, as I said, the first part is just telling where you are, what do you do and how do you do? And the second part is how would you like ChatGPT to respond? So how formal or casual should ChatGPT be? How long or short should response generally be? How do you want to be addressed? Should ChatGPT have options on topic remain neutral? So you can say like um, all the answers, uh, depend on my career and lively livelihood. Um, please uh, check what you wrote and analyze if you are correct. So, for example, if you say is Malta based, let's create a new chat first. Uh, is Malta based in uh, Sia? Sia? It's gonna answer much more prominently than it would before because we said the livelihood depends, my career depends on this, and that's the reason it answers like that. If we didn't have it, it just said no. So that's basically two things that you can implement right now into your chat GPT, into your GPT-4, and get 10x the results. And it's actually incredible what you can get with it. Make sure to use it and put in the comments what prompts you use, because I'm blown away by just small things that I added, which bring incredible change to the way ChatGPT responds.